The leader of Iran's Islamic Revolution has said Tel Aviv will be razed to the ground if Israel attacks Iran. Gahi, gahi sardam dara, sardam daran regime sahiyunisti maro tahdid ham mikonan, tahdid be hamle nizami mikonan. Amo be nazaram khodeshon ham midanan, va agar nemidanan bedanan ke agar galati az onha sar bezanat. جمهوری اسلامی تل آویو و هیفا رو با خاک یکسان خواهد کرد Well, Tell us that Ali Khamenei criticized the U.S. and its Western allies, including the U.K., for the public enmity towards Iran. He said such a hostile approach is unwise. He also said the U.S. does not want the dispute over Iran's nuclear energy program to be resolved. That's because it wants to put further pressure on the Iranian nation, but Iran will never be brought to its knees. He said further that anti-Iran sanctions have activated the internal capabilities of the country despite their negative impact and have contributed to great technological achievements. Ayatollah Khamenei said there are some who are displeased with Iran's progress and are trying to undermine its achievements through media propaganda. He said the Iranian nation has, however, emerged proud and victorious in spite of the enemy's plots and that today, without Iran's vote, no significant issue in the region can be resolved. The leader of Iran's Islamic Revolution made the remarks during an address to the public in the northeastern holy city of Mashhad. Let's get the thoughts of, the, of Fouad Azadi, who's a professor at the University of Tehran. He joins us from the capital, Tehran. Fouad Azadi, uh, Israel, the possessor, possessor of uh, Middle East's uh, uh, nuclear weapons, uh, which he, they have under declared it, uh, based on numerous threats on attacking Iran, has gotten a response from Iran's leader. What was your reaction based on uh, what Iran's leader has said regarding those numerous threats? Well, um, as you know, uh, Israeli leaders uh, threaten Iran uh, almost on a daily basis uh, and um, basically have increased this type of uh, rhetoric uh, recently. Yeah, yesterday, Netanyahu was repeating the same accusations against Iran and threatening Iran again. So it's uh, just natural for uh, the leader of Islamic Revolution to respond to this level of uh, rhetoric. Uh, they are some analysts uh, in the Israeli side and the U.S. side that uh, think if, they, if Israelis attack Iran, Iran may not respond uh, in a similar manner. And that's a big mistake. And I think the leader of Islamic Revolution made this clear today. So memo